Boston Red Sox hosting the Detroit Tigers. And the Tigers are plus 140 on the money line. The Red Sox are minus 165. The over-under is nine runs. The Tigers, getting a run and a half, are minus 140, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. The Red Sox, laying a run and a half, are plus 120, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win this game by two. Now, I'm always going to butcher his last name. Brisky has pitched, hasn't pitched against the Red Sox yet. He's a rookie, so this is his first appearance against them. Hill pitched once against the Tigers this year. Four and a third, three runs, three earned. The Red Sox won that game five to three. Now, the Red Sox are on a two-game winning streak overall. The Tigers are on a one-game losing streak overall. The Red Sox are 18 and 16 at home this year, and the Tigers are 8 and 19 on the road this year. Head-to-head, -head, Boston's on a three-game winning streak against the Tigers. The Red Sox are 6 and 4 against them in their past 10. The favorite winning the game by two is 6 and 4. The under is 6 and 4, and the under 9 specifically is 5, 4, and 1. In their last 10 games now initially i was leaning towards the tigers with the the money line but because of how badly they've struggled on the road i'm going to take the red sox with the money line the tigers with the runs and i'm going to go under let's see if the numbers are right let's see if the numbers are wrong